All right, on to the last two boxes. See if we can get some more silver or a buffalo nickel or that elusive 1955. Or anything for my book. Like I said, I just started the book in January, so all those coins are from this year except for one of the war nickels. So I'm having a good year. But I'll get back with you. Well, before I start this next box, I just realized something. I forgot to take the two other war nickels and I tossed them in the bag with the 40 nickels, or the 1940s nickels. So I gotta go through this first before I forget. That was a stupid moment, wasn't it? Well, this is the results from the last two boxes out of the five boxes I had. And this time I got skunked on silver. Out of the two boxes, no silvers. But I still can't complain. I got a 1939, two 1940s, a 1940D, eight 1941s, a 1941D. And then see, no silver out of these last two boxes. Then two 1946s, three 1947s, 1947S, three. 1948s, 1949, 1952, 52D, 53, I got two of them, a 53D, 1954, four 1955s, or 1954Ds, a few 1955Ds, three 1956, two 1956Ds, a few 57Ds, 58Ds, a couple 59s, and a few 59Ds. And I ended up with 18 more Canadian nickels, and I did get one 1947 Canadian nickel, which was cool to find, so I can't complain about that. And a 2009P. So, not a bad hunt, but I think I'm going to do a year-to-date video and show you what I got so far this year. Thanks for watching. Well, this will just be a quick update of this year's 2014's find so far. These are all my silvers. I got 36 silvers so far, 9 Witcher halves, and 12 silver dimes, 1 Canadian, and 15 silver nickels, war nickels. So I can't complain about that, and that all equals up to my 36 silvers so far this year. And then these, I got three S-mints, the proofs, for the halves. I got two of the 1982 P's with no designer initials on the back. I got Funky Heart and Seven, one that somebody did something to. And that H or KJB Seven, nickel. Then I had a couple older Canadian nickels and four Buffalo so far this year. 1930, 1936, two 1936s, 1937, then I got two proof nickels, a 1984S and a 1999S, and I, one, two, three, four, five of the 2009 P dimes, and 12 2009 nickels, and that 1989P, it looks like it has three rims on it, and then that one with that booger on it, that penny, and then these are all my foreign coins. Those are all um, King George Canadian pennies down there on the bottom. And then from the other countries right there. And those are 25 of the 2002 and up halves. And over here, that's the bag of the 50s nickels, 40s nickels, the 30s nickels. And those are all the S-mints from the, um, the older S-mint ones. And those are my wheats from the five boxes of pennies so far. Those are all the 50s, the 40s, and the 30s, 20s, and teens. I think there's three or four in there. And those are all the S-Mint pennies. And then these are all the commemorative 2009s. That's the birth and early years, the formative years, and the professional life, and the presidency. So... In a month, I've found 36 silver uh, coins so far, and some oddball ones, and some other cool stuff. So yeah, it's a lot of fun. You just never know what you're going to find doing this. 
And uh, now it's time for me to kind of slow it down a bit, though, and look for more of the errors and look for some of that stuff. Because, like, I did get that cherry um, picker's book, so we shall see what happens. But thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, and yeah, it's out there. 36 silver so far this year, coin roll hunting, and some other good stuff. So go to it and see what you can find.